What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. Just got this. It's a Boundary Conference microphone, touch sensor technology. And I wanted to show this to you here. You know, I use uh, one of those stand-up desk mics, uh, those keratoid microphones a lot. But one of the cool things is, uh, you know, that uh, recording stuff on audio is kind of a communal thing. And sometimes you have a buddy around with you. Sometimes you're trying to uh, take a conference call together. And so those types of microphones, which are really just personal microphones, they sit right in front of you and they kind of have a pickup range that's right in front of it, aren't great for kind of doing joint things. And I like doing joint things. So I picked this up because I thought this would be a nice slim way. It kind of almost looks to me like those uh, work you know, desk, conference room, speaker phones. And so, you know, it's very flat. It's kind of alien looking. It looks like a cockpit here. Uh, it's very, it's quite heavy, actually. It's like metal construction. Even the grate here is metal. Looks like we have a touch power button on the top here. We have a nylon braided covered power cord or connection on it. We also have two screw holes here, kind of like key mods. So you could actually mount this, I guess, on a wall like that if you needed it uh, maybe above your monitor or something like that, too. We have a pretty long... Uh, cable here, which is just going to be a USB cable. Looks like gold plated connector, and I will extend this out. Oh, okay, this is like a five foot long cable. So you could definitely have this connected to a computer and then run to the center of a table. So if you're having a meeting with a bunch of people, you'll have no problems gathering around it. So what I want to do is hook this up to my computer and record some audio with this and see what we think about it. Let's give it a try. All right, sitting in front of my computer and I've got the microphone plugged in here. You can see that it has a little touch sensitive button on the top, it's like that, boom. And it kind of just dawned on me that turning it off was going to turn off my microphone pickup on this thing. So anyway, all I want to do is I'm just going to put it down here uh, on the top of my desk right in front of me and I just want to talk into it. And I actually want to move around a little bit too, just to kind of, uh, demonstrate the pickup on it. So, you know, I'm only a couple feet away from it here, uh, you know, and I'm talking a little bit maybe more elevated than I would just in a normal, casual, uh, calm conversation. But, you know, the, the assumption here is that you might have someone back here also speaking into it, you know, four or five feet away, and then even at maybe someone further uh, at the edge of the table or at the edge of a conference table or, you know, five, six, seven feet away. So, you know, this is the pickup that you can expect. I think this is kind of really interesting because like I said, it's not just a personal mic. It really is a microphone for putting people around you. So whether you are just plugging this in to your computer to record some audio for a podcast, maybe you're just trying to interview friends and family, maybe you're just trying to capture a discussion, maybe you're spending the holidays with, uh, with, uh, uh, elderly uh, folks that you want to capture all those stories, you can put a bunch of people around here without having to set up individual mics. So I really like this. And the small form factor means it's really easy to take with you too. So for me, when I like going on the road or something, you know, and especially visiting my other buddies or something like that, I want to capture some really good audio. You know, taking this little guy with me is going to be what I'm going to do because it means I don't have to pack up a, a big mic, which kind of goes into a big like pelican like case so check it out um you'll have to judge the audio quality for yourself because i'm not listening to this live i'll listen to it afterwards but uh if you like it i wouldn't hesitate to pick one up i'll put a link to the description peter von panda out